Okay, part two of the first video for the third brake light leaking in a 2010 Ford F-150. What I've gone ahead and done is I've cleaned the area. I've taken off the duct tape, obviously, off the top. I've cleaned it with xylene because after you leave duct tape on steel for a couple of months, well, it just sticks on there. We got it off. Then, <clears throat> once I get all the duct tape off, I cleaned it with brake, brake cleaning fluid to kind of prep the area for the silicone that we were going to put on it. Now, the silicone I used, if you can read this little thing, is just General Electric standard silicone. It's not technically an exterior silicone, but, you know, it's a truck. It's, it is what it is. Plus, it's a, it's a guaranteed for life product. Anyway, um, rule number one, don't apply silicone to a dirty surface, so clean it first. Rule number two, don't apply silicone when it's too hot or too cold. Too hot would be over 80, too cold would be under 50. So try to keep it in that range. It can be done, but it gets messy because this becomes um, harder to work with. If it's too cold, it'll be too hard. And if it's too hot, well, then it'll be um, it's almost like water coming out of that container. So I've taped off the area before I even took the third brake light out. And what this did was it gives me an area to... Um, after and I'm, I'll show you too is I'll run my finger along that silicone bead and it it won't get all over my truck and it'll be easy to wipe away with a rag. So what I've gone ahead and done is I've siliconed the outside of it right along that gasket and I've was pretty liberal because we don't want that water getting in there and we'll apply a layer on the outside once we get the screws in. And I don't, I didn't have to, but I put a little bead on the bottom just in case. Um, note to self, uh, if you are going to do this, make sure you replace all your bulbs. These three little bulbs in the top, and they're all the same. Um, I didn't because I just did it about two months ago when I duct taped it. But uh, I think the bulbs, I can't even remember what I replaced them with. But replace those because hopefully this is a one-time thing where you have to take your third light out. Otherwise, you've got to cut the silicone and do this all over again, in which case you'll be better at it. But I'm going to go ahead and set this, set this up. I don't know where I'm going to. 